welcome to the place. You, as you know, you're an atheist, and as you know, I am a Christian. My whole agenda is to find out what can we agree on, not, this is no debate, this isn't like, oh, we disagree, let's argue. No, we're not trying to prove each other wrong. We're trying to see. But what can we agree on despite the obvious thing that we don't agree on? So, here's the topic for this video. I recently made one talking about how I don't care about sports. Let's talk about one how, in theory, I don't care about politics or specifically it's like I'm an agnostic towards politics in the same way I am about sports. Politics in the United States, bipartisan system, pointless. If one was superior to the other, then we would discontinue every election choosing from that side of the invisible line that we drew. When ultimately, who's going to get elected? Typically the person who's kind of the moderate and we just kind of swing back and forth every couple of elections. But it's all pointless. You know, it, 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 people have this false concept. Well, this is what I believe. So if I believe this is the right thing and you know, we need to have a political party that embrace what I believe. But here's the thing, half of what Democrats believe is wrong and half of what Republicans believe is wrong. Half of what Democrats believe is right, half of what Republicans believe is right. And then on top of that, there's a Venn diagram. There's a lot of what both of them believe is wrong just by default because they're buying into a system that some kind of political party is going to save us. So I think the whole thing's pointless. And what I wonder is, in the same way that I can unplug from the system, the bipartisanship, in the same way that my brain's tuned into, hey guys, this is pointless. Ultimately, we're doing the same stuff over and over. It doesn't matter which political party is, has a president. We're still going to end up in war, right? We're still going to end up policing the world. We're just going to keep sacrificing our men, our soldiers, our women, for the sake of fighting for freedom, protecting our country, while we continue to be engaged in war with the Middle East, when the people who hijacked that plane and crashed in the Twin Towers, Saudi Arabia, yeah, that's where they were from. They weren't from the countries we're attacking. That ought to raise an eyebrow. See, I've unplugged from the political system. Yes, I officially identify as a libertarian, but I know that that's not mainstream, that's not popular opinion. But step one is unplugging from the belief that Democrats or Republicans are superior to the other. So I just wonder, I would have to think that that sort of brain, if you're an atheist and you can unplug from a major system, that you could also easily unplug from believing in Republicans and Democrats. I see a lot of overlap. I see a Venn diagram overlap. Whereas you're an atheist, whereas I don't believe in the byproducts and I don't believe in Republicans and Democrats. And we've, we can at least agree on this. The whole point of this video is what can we agree on? Are we in the middle of this Venn diagram where despite our religious differences or our, you don't believe in God, I do whatever, but ultimately we can at least agree it's a very pointless and broken system. Swinging both ways. Oh, Republican. Oh, Democrat. Oh, you're wrong. Oh, you're immoral. Oh, you're ignorant. And they, they all think that about themselves. Republicans and Democrats think each other are, are ignorant, immoral. That's what they think about each other. Ignorant and immoral. And wrong, of course. They think that about each other. It's spy versus spy. You know the classic Mad Magazine where the one was black, one was white, but neither was the good or the bad guy? Like, that's how pointless it is. So can we agree, at least we have that in common, we share that same vision? Because I know that there are atheists who are Republicans, there are atheists that are Democrats, but what about those of us who are just unplugged from the system and I just happen to be the Christian who's siding with you, saying, yeah, man, hey, hey, right? That was a fist bump. I wasn't punching in the face, that was a fist bump. Hey, we can agree on this. Your comments belong right here.